Hi there, welcome back. Can you find a and b in the equation 2 to the power of a less 2 to the power of b equals 1008, given that a and b are both positive integers? Pause the video now if you want to try it yourself. OK, let's begin. Since a and b are both positive integers, a must be greater than b. And if we were to say that, say, k is the difference between a and b, then we can say that a equals b plus k. We can therefore rewrite the above as 2b plus k less 2b equals 1008. And if we now utilise the rule that says a number raised to a power multiplied by the same number raised to a different power equals that same number to those powers added together, then we can rewrite this as 2 to the power of b multiplied by 2 to the power of k less 2 to the power of b equals 1008. This then allows us to factorise the left hand side by pulling out 2b. So we get 2b multiplied by 2k less 1 still equal to 1008. Now let's break 1008 down into prime factors. So if we start with 1008 and divide it by 2, we get 504. And if we divide by 2 again, we get 252. And if we divide by 2 again, we get 126. And finally, if we divide by 2 again, we get 63. And there, I'm going to stop. Since I finished dividing by 2, and 2 is the base that I'm interested in. So summarising, 1008 is equal to 2 to the power of 4 multiplied by 63. And if we match this up with the left hand side of this equation, we can say that 2 to the power of b equals 2 to the 4 and 2 to the power of k less 1 equals 63. Since the bases here are the same, we can conclude that b must equal 4. And rearranging here, we get that 2k must equal 63 plus 1, which is 64. Therefore, 2k equals 2 to the power of 6. And again, as the bases are equal, we can set the powers equal, and k equals 6. And since we know that a equals b plus k, we can say that a must equal 4 plus 6. So a equals 10. And therefore these are our answers. Did you get it? Hope you enjoyed that. See you tomorrow for another video. Or maybe in a few seconds if you click on one of these. See ya.